Let's compare these three lighting setups. This is me with no lights in front of me. This is me with two cheap soft boxes from Amazon. And this is me with an expensive lighting setup. Let's talk about how you should be lighting your videos and streams. This is three point lighting and it is the gold standard for good lighting on camera. You have your key light, which provides most of the light that's going on to you or the subject in the video. For this setup, I'm using an Amaran 200XS light with a small rig soft box attached to it with a honeycomb grid. You have a fill light, which is about 45 degrees off to the side of the subject. It's gonna be a little bit dimmer. Sometimes you can use a different temperature. My fill light off to the side is one of those Amazon soft boxes that I talked about earlier. And I only use this when I'm streaming, but if you're feeling fancy, you can have a third light behind you that's kind of like shining on your hair in a way. People will use like a smaller light that they can hide behind their head or one that's like slightly off camera. It's to separate you from the background. I don't bother with that when I'm recording my content. I have a light that kind of lights up back there as my separation, but I don't have the proper three point lighting during most of my videos, surprise. So let's go through those options again. Here we have no lights. Here's two cheap soft boxes from Amazon. And here's an expensive professional light and one of those soft boxes from Amazon. Which lighting do you think looks the best? I need to validate that money that I spent on that Amaran.